Hello and welcome to another Union Arena unboxing. This is my, my second U Union Arena box ever. My first one was the Code GS one. And I'm beyond happy that I got the Nikki Goddess of Victory box. Because this box is very uh, popular. It's very hard to get and yeah. Very, very happy. I also did buy a, a deck. But I have no idea if there is like a, a special card you can get i i guess they they make a lot of things uh, similar to weiss schwarz so maybe they have some exclusive rarity cards in in the trial deck or how this deck is called is a trial deck but yeah let's find out what's inside this and i did buy another like a second booster box but i will open this one in a in a live stream so maybe subscribe and uh, hit the the bell notification thingy so you don't miss my my live streams in general i will uh, live stream a lot more in the future i just uh, enjoy them a thousand times more than like now opening cards just for myself i really really do like talking to you and uh, yeah having a nice time in the live stream so i will do less unboxings like this and more more live streams i hope you you are fine with that let's go into the into the deck of course i can't read like really japanese and i don't play the game so far but okay we get like the the view from be behind interesting yeah i don't know the all the character's name but i did took a look into the the card gallery Oh, and this is uh, the SR. Okay, this looks like the regular SR. It's not like a special version. There's no texture on the card or no, no gold stamping. But it looks sweet. Nice, nice foiling. You can see like the highlight on her accessory. I don't know how the name is for this thingy. Oh, and th we've got more foils. Okay. So two more SRs. Uh, this is Ra Rapi. These are Karaganas for, should be Ra Rapi, if I'm not wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, probably there are already like 20 comments from Nikki Got A Story hardcore players who are insulting me that I don't know the character's name, I'm sorry. Uh, Hero move, okay. Hero move. Now I I have tried to to practice more reading like hiragana and katagana, and I I should be able to read most of them. Anisu, this is Anisu. Uh, is her is she my favorite one? Yeah, there is a a two star parallel of of this character. And this is actually my my favorite hit of the of the whole set. It's not even loot. Like there are some loot artworks in this in this release, but I I actually don't really want the loot ones. I want the the Anisu card. She looks like the the nice girl next in your in your neighborhood. Like I I really do like the the artwork, but yeah. Chances are probably very low, even like with two boxes, but I, I couldn't afford to buy more. These are expensive and yeah, times are tough. We have Ar Arisu. Mm -hmm. Oh, and there's like something. It's a rare plus. Okay. That's cute. Uh, what do we have? Su Suno? Oh. Oh, oh my god, Ho Wa Ho Wai Ho Wai To. I think the last one I can't read. But anyway, you are not here to <laughs> to watch me try to read uh, Katagana, probably. Oh, <laughs> let's go into the box. Uh, how many packs do we have? I would guess like 16. 16, yeah. In the beginning, like the Union Arena boxes had more packs, I think, but less hits, and then they changed it. And in, in general, I have really high hopes for Union Arena, like not only because of uh, this release, 
like in general i really do feel like bandai wants to to make this work like they put a lot of effort and resource resources into this tcg and i know they have like multiple tcgs at the same time but I, I do feel they try to make Union Arena work. Huh. Nice. Uh, this is another Ani, Anisu, right? Yeah, this is the character I want to pull. And uh, yeah, I, I do feel they, they try just a, a rare foil. There should be at least one. Man, I, I just looked it up yesterday, but I've already forgotten the ratio for the four or five super rares. They also have like very subtle texture in the background. And then there should be one or two parallels. Oh yeah. Uh, it's so, oh, it's so funny that we see like most of the characters from behind. <laughs> but it, maybe it's like the, the same feeling like playing the game. And this is our first SR of R Rupee. Could this be the case, Rupee? Maybe I shouldn't have said in the beginning that I, I can read uh, Karagana. No, I just messed them all up. This is Uni. Today we, we learn on in, in Veep Investments on my channel, we, le we learn Japanese while opening cards. Maybe this is like, uh, like a niche on YouTube I should aim at. <laughs> Japanese learning with waifu is probably like everyone would be able to speak Japanese in a week because of the the moral boost of uh, waifus would be my guess. Another way. Ah, uh, this time it's ha oh ha ha. Oh, I always mess the last one up. What was it? Hara. So or Hara. Chi. Of course, I don't remember. Uh, okay. Another rare. I think the the parallel foils can also be like non-character cards which would feel kind of bad when it's just like one of the, the action cards. Another SR. Oh, it's Apu. Okay, I don't try to, to read. This probably takes too long, but she, she looks like a nun. Oh, and I do like the texture. I should show the cards a little bit more maybe. But there's some nice texture on the card. Oh, these look very nice, just for the SR. I think in the beginning of Union Arena, the SRs weren't like this, not as good. Just a rare. Another nice one. And we have already like half of the box, half of the box with two SR cards. I do really want to open the second box soon, but I don't know at the moment when I have the time for opening them. And of course I will not just stream for for one box of Nikki. I will open probably some some Shadowverse Evolve or uh Lillians of Enemy X. It's a another Japanese TCG, but most people haven't heard of it, but uh the the cards have very nice texture and foiling. And I have like quite a few unboxings. Oh, it's a SR. Oh, just a, okay. Oh, it's the it's the character I like, Anisu. Oh, she she looks very nice. I do like her. Oh, and the oh the texture on the gun. This texture looks even better than from the other SR cards, but it's not a parallel if I'm if I'm not confused, because there should be like a little. A little star next to the rarity. Ah. Okay, we have just another rare. Oh, she looks cool too. That's a nice, 
this character design, but most of the designs look like very appealing. I think like they are they are aimed towards like people in my age, I guess, with money. Except I don't have the money. I don't have the money for gacha games. I never have never spent money on on any gacha. The closest to this would be like uh, Legend of Terror. It's a it's a card game and it's super friendly for uh, for players who don't want to spend money on it. But uh, yeah, I just was so happy with the game that I I just bought something in the games to give them money. Oh, it's a rare plus. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a nice one. Could it's just a rare plus and not a not a double plus, but okay. That's one of the the nicer ones, I guess. I I do like what I see. No complaints from me. Yeah, I I hope we just get like a a restock. I hope they produce more of this set. But they should wait like one month or more so I can uh, save some money. If they release a, a second wave like in two weeks, I'm like, oh man. I just haven't, my, my bank account hasn't recovered. Ah. <sighs> But we have three more packs, uh, two more packs after this one. Another rare. But yeah, I, I did open the Kochi S and I had the feeling that the SR cards were not as good textured as this one. So I guess they are still improving. Another SR. Okay. Uh, yeah, Ra Rapi. Probably, if I'm not misreading this. Looks like one of the main girls. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Man, I'm so stupid. Pulling the, the character on the booster packs and I'm trying to be like a smart ass and be like, oh, haha, she's probably one of the... Yeah, of course. You idiot, she's on the packs. But yeah, for more unboxings, please check out my channel and yeah. As I said, my second box I will open in a live stream and maybe you want to say hello. So yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.